We are learning more this morning about how you can give back to our local community with the Ronald McDonald House. And joining us now to tell us all about it is Bethany Ramsey and also Stephen Overby. He owns a McDonald's here in our area. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thanks for having us. First of all, tell us a little bit about what's going to be going on on Friday and how we can participate. So you've already heard that you can make a change on Friday from 7 to 10.30 a.m. You get to stop by McDonald's and get a breakfast or coffee and drop your change. Your coins, your dollar bills, your quarters. I mean, anything, it all adds up just in breakfast time. It does make a big difference. I know that you are, Stephen, so excited to be a part of this each and every year. How does it make you feel to know that you are giving back to your local community? Well, Ronald McDonald House is absolutely one of my favorite charities. Um, we give back all year long through McDonald's to Ronald McDonald House, but the day of change is a big day for them. So this is almost like $20,000 that they raise in one single day from, from this. Um, but all year long, you can round up your change at, for Ronald McDonald House or donate through the buckets at, at McDonald's. And Bethany, how does this make a difference here in our community? I know it does so much for so many families. Yeah, so when a family lives an hour or even 45 minutes away, it makes a huge difference when your child is in the hospital and they're sick and you just wanna be close to them. Um, and then you're not thinking about traveling back and forth. You're not thinking about having to stay in a hotel. Everything's provided at our house. We call it a home away from home. It's it, so true. It is. And you don't think about it. You, you're yeah. out there. You think this could never happen to my children. Mm -hmm. This could never happen. I could never need to yeah. stay there. But it's not true. Th things happen. Yes. And this is why it's so important to have facilities like this right here in the Tennessee Valley. Yeah, absolutely. I couldn't agree more. And then, I mean, it makes a difference in that day. Over 20,000 is raised, just like Stephen said. And you guys have raised, what, 151000 throughout mm -hmm. the years for this house. Yeah, isn't that crazy? It's so important, <laughs> yes. All right, Stephen, tell us a little bit about how we can do this. When we go to the McDonald's, when we go buy our breakfast, you just dump it in right there at the drive-thru? Yeah, several uh, McDonald's are going to have volunteers out in the drive-thru. So when you pull up, it might be a little crazy out there, but they'll have uh, board members, uh, local celebrities, football players, cheerleaders, everything from the Chattanooga area are going to be spread out across. Um, so at any McDonald's you can donate, but several are going to have awesome volunteers out there to get your, get your change from you. And Bethany, what is your goal this year? What do you hope to raise money for? How much? Um, obviously, we hope to go over 20000 but we're always shooting for the stars. So if we got 30000 or 40000 <laughs> that would be amazing. It would. <laughs> Bethany, can you tell us about a personal story about someone impacted right here in the Tennessee Valley that benefited from a day like this? Yeah, so we've had a lot of families that have been impacted. Actually, Stephen and his family um, had to use our Ronald McDonald family room. Um, so there are different aspects, but I interviewed a family recently who they had twin boys in the hospital. And when one got out early, they were able to still stay close to their other son who was there. And they lived about an hour and a half away um, on the other side of Cleveland. And so that's just that drive. And then having another kid to care for, but still having a home for him, that was so important to them. And Stephen, that's so special to know that you are giving back and you're making a difference this mm -hmm. Friday when you yourself were impacted by this and got to use Absolutely. the facilities. Absolutely. You are correct. You never think that you're going to use the facilities until it happens. That's true. <laughs> All right. All right, folks, we are going to encourage you to get out on Friday yes. for the Day of Change. All you need to do is go buy your area McDonald's. They are hoping to raise over $20,000 on Friday alone. We're hoping you have any spare change you might have in your house. Check your couch cushions, check yes. wherever, and get your change out, <laughs> your dollar bills, and help the wrong Ronald McDonald House right here in the Tennessee Valley. Thank you guys so much for joining us this morning and what you're doing for the community. Thank you. Thank you. All right. We have much more ahead on News 12 Now this morning. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this.